I haven't got a clue to be honest with you. If we did not see us, we're just sitting out and getting our bits and pieces. We don't need to do a big clock, really, do we? everyone and welcome to friday how are we all doing today so yes the boys have just gone off to school absolutely no issues from bed and nothing to say which is really great sometimes he will say he struggles a bit on the bus because there's like that first little step sometimes he just needs that little bit of encouragement some to put his foot on that first step and he comes up himself but today he did it by himself which was really lovely just as well because again i've had no carers and again this morning that care agency are absolutely hopeless now because obviously Ben's two original carers left. So um, let's get in. We are getting someone come in, well, supposed to be coming in. I want to say he isn't exactly that great. He isn't, you can tell he's not changing, changing behaviour or nothing like that. But again, it's, it's been twice this week. It was Tuesday and today. I've had no phone calls, no texts, no nothing. So I don't know what's going on. I really don't know. So I need to text the manager and find out what's going on because technically they're being paid. So technically they owe us to. Technically, there was two and a half hours now, basically. So, but like I said, I'm grateful I managed to get him on myself. But again, if he's having a bad day, there's no way I'll be able to get him on. And um, one is obviously loving school, and which is really, really lovely to see. I want to try and encourage that routine. So, I hope, fingers crossed, touch, and touch wood, we won't have any more bad days. But who you knows, so Ben? One minute is up, next is down. So, but anyway, yeah, so this morning, it's a lovely, lovely, lovely day out there again, actually. A bit of a frost this morning. I'm so glad I carried up my strawberries and my tomatoes last night because, again, it wasn't a sharp frost or nothing like that. So, but just good and covered anyway. Also, got a little bit, last bit of washing to put out there. I need to put that out. I'm also going around, to go around the market in a bit as well. Obviously, we, we did plan to go down last week, but obviously, we've been in the hospital, we've just moved around to it. So, we'll see what's we we'll get some big, massive jacket potatoes, get some of that, and a bit of fruit and veg because we find again, that's the same the fruit and veg like Aldi and Tesco's they don't last because obviously, when we went to Tesco's beginning of the week and got a couple of bits and pieces got some bananas within two days i've got a manky at least the market that do actually last and obviously then we need to pop to be in there and we get a couple of bits as well obviously we've come home from work definitely need to get a close horse oh on there because the other day ben just pushed it out the way to get his trifle and basically he flattened it actually broke it he broke all the metal railings not none the rail they're the little things that hold it into place he broke that but it was old anyway I don't know, it's even just about something about going to the tips. I don't know if it's going to go there. I'm not, I'll just have to wait and see what he says. So, anyway, like I said, I'll make myself a cup of tea now because, again, I've had to rotate my game myself this morning. By the time I got around drinking my tea, it was cold. So, yes, yeah, so anyway, I had a um, nice walk around the market. I managed to get a couple of bits and pieces. Look at the big, massive jack of potatoes that we wanted, though, could we? Yeah. Didn't have any at all. They didn't have a single potato. So, I don't know, um, I was a bit late to go around, so I don't know if they sold any. I really did not know. I managed to get some nice big fat juicy strawberries as well, some bananas, some grapes and also some raspberries as well. I wanted some blackberries and some blueberries but they said they didn't have any it's because obviously they get it from the wholesaler in somewhere down London area, it's a big market and they said they didn't look that great so which is fair enough. So we were just heading off to Aldi to do our shopping now anyway aren't we? So what's that keep hitting the window screen? I feel like little chips or something hitting the window, I don't know where that is from. Uh, but so they, they have been doing the regular size, I know it's left over from there, I do not know. So, but like I said, yes, we did head off to Aldi to do our shopping. Sam needs to give us a list of what things he wants. Um, I know we went to Aldi a couple of weeks ago, he was a bit disappointed because he couldn't get his pies, he wanted to draw his cookie pie. So, hopefully, they've got trying with them for him. And also, like I said, we need to pop into B now, we need to get myself a new clothes horse because Ben flattened mine, did the other day. <laughs> He just wiped it out to it is great. I did like so we did try and fix it but it just didn't work. So and again it's another lovely day out in another cloud in the sky it's actually say sixteen degrees on the car, isn't it? Yeah, no, I feel tired. You feel yeah. tired today, so um this is definitely a forty three. You can see actually the road is you can see it's nice what they've done because they've actually completed the 
come up the whole road. Well, not the patch, but well, that side. That side, DJ, not this side, though, is it? So it was a whole thing that's cross We can get what we want from Aldi because when we went to one and back in the middle of the week, it was just on the shelves. So, yeah, so just in B&M now, the car park looked quite busy, but actually, see here, there's nobody around, not unless they're all up the tills, don't know, because obviously they just put an announcement in for train staff for tills. So, also, just put some of these in. Um, sea potatoes and rice papers ones so, what are they one ninety nine each I think they was or three for a fiver last year really good success with our potatoes didn't we mm. that's a good packet of tea bags how much is that oh, I know like, what you like with your tea <laughs> well, just, 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 just put some bleach in one thing we do know we need only definitely some hand wash don't we all right for clean and stuff for that as well and that because we just bought a whole load I'm um, all right for Softener. What's it do? It makes it smell very nice. Oh, does it? Okay. I've got Lenore stuff at home. Oh, yeah. yeah. Obviously, because the coffee things and well, they're different, aren't they? Different flavours there. And then Mum loves our coffee machine we bought for Christmas. Guess if you want some. Which one do you want? We'll get the um. Plus the Galaxy one for a change. No, no, Ben might like hot chocolate. Oh, what's Mary? Let's try some Mary hot chocolate. Yeah, you have one. Yeah, so I'll grab one. Oh, the, the Galaxy there's 129. It's up to you, it's going to be fancy. Grab any one. Should we have the area one, yeah? Mm. Okay. Right, if we're going to Aldi, do I get the cookies from Aldi for Sammy, yeah? Because we know he does like these, but he does prefer the, the Aldi ones. So that I am going to get for these. So these are quite nice. These Twix top things. Get some of them. Put them in the trolley. That's why I can't believe we got that big packet of tea bags. It's crazy. Yeah, it does last, doesn't it? So, I'll tell you what, Sammy did like. He liked those Maryland cookie little individual packets, didn't he? Yeah, he didn't like them. Did you like them? Yeah. I you like them. Yeah. Didn't want them. Okay. Do you want some club biscuits? That's what here. Remember, I used to call these dead fly biscuits with the raisins in. Hmm. The flavour Kit Kats they got now is crazy. Got honeycomb, the white ones which are just there. Lemon drizzle maybe? And chocolate hazelnut spread. Orange. I'm not too quite sure what that one is there. Yeah, Steve was on about getting the shed for the bottom of the garden and he said it'll probably won't be on the flat one, not unless you put like a little concrete base or on a concrete base or something like that, you know? We can't be bothered now, so. The thing is, now we're not losing the garage, it's like the store, okay, storage space on there. And so, so once they've got any veggies, it's already, already started, because I said mine aren't growing yet. I'm getting a bit impatient. <laughs> well, we've got around the corner around here then, darling. Okay, so we've got some around here. They've got some grey rose sweet corn there, three for five pound or two for each. Got some of them, we've got some Brussels sprouts there. And they're going some cabbages down there. Some lettuce. I don't. I don't. I don't. I don't do they. What about the sweet corn? Did we have some success with the sweet corn before? Yes, I'm looking for the caramel bars or buttons because Ben absolutely really, really loves those. Being in one place, you get them from. Which if I can't seem to find any anywhere, doesn't do much for this with you. Got the orange buttons there, big buttons there. No, luckily he's not fussy, but I thought what he's been through the last couple of weeks, it'd be nice to get them for him. Obviously, they last. we don't normally give him sweets. We do have sweets every day, but we do limit, so they don't eat loads. Um, I thought it was good for him, actually, to be honest with you. Is it there? He likes. Let's get the white buttons, he seems to enjoy them and they get the normal ones of Sammy, I think. I haven't got a clue to be honest with you, if he did not see us. We just sit in Aldi getting our bits and pieces and we don't need to do a big clock really, do we? There you go. I wonder, fish and lemon. Oh, the lemon and garlic fish gooey guns. Let's see what they've got on here. Because obviously you have to get bored eating the same old things each time. Do you any burgers on that? Do you like those burgers you had the other day? What are they? They're the ultimate burger. What's he found there? Oh, you've got your square sausage. You love your square sausage, don't you? Oh, no, so I want this pie, this cookie pie. Hoping, of course, we can find them. 
Oh my. These burgers. Do you want some of them? Yeah. Do you want some of these burgers? You liked this last time, didn't you? Yeah, but yeah, with these ones, you actually look like, tucked into these burgers, and you can see they're gluten free as well. So, they could have them, which is great. Obviously, me and Sammy want to eat them. Well, that's a bit different. Oh, well, that's different, darling. That's not as nice. Look, loaded chicken fillet with pork. Oh, there's chili sauce. Nah, I don't think I've just got chili on it. A chicken on crit, he'll be happy. Let's get his pies for him, one of them for him. They got the ones we normally buy. I can't even try those ones, but he'll be happy he's got them. But oh, they're different, aren't they? What are they? Some chicken, chicken burger, gooey gone on the things. Oh. Let's see, the shelves are quite full actually here, so it's pretty good. I was going to be busy. It wasn't. Do you want chicken for Sunday? Do you want chicken for Sunday? Oh, got extra large. I want to stay on it. 30th of April. When's that? That's free yeah, that'll be fine. Let's get one of them. That's good, obviously, Sam's going to miss this chicken on Sunday. Are those the gluten free ones, the tempura ones? Are they gluten free ones? Yeah, get it, because even Sam likes so, so they'll be right to in the freezer for Ben. Around here, Sketty. Ben's a right for Sketty, isn't he? I think he is. I'll leave that for now, because obviously he has some of these before and he actually really enjoyed them. And they're actually gluten free so we can have them as well. Yeah they got some this week Ben be happy because we're getting some tempura fish goo gongs and then there's also some chunky cod fish fingers for him so he'd be right with them. They used to do the um the big massive piece of fish in them as well but they don't seem to find them anymore because they're normal fish fillets things there. So yeah, he'll be happy with them anyway. Oh that's a trolley so see we don't want all that much from there anyway. Do you wanna Get some ready meals or something for the kids for the weekend for tomorrow lunchtime or not? What's the other thing the kids would like anyway? I'm doing this get one to tea tonight anyway, so don't want that then. Potato croquets, mashed potatoes or stuff. I don't know. Hey do I wonder if Sam would like that. Mac and cheese, crisp like it's like macaroni cheese. He loves macaroni cheese, doesn't he? I'm sure they're 129. I think we'll have to ask them actually. Very well, go get one of these for myself. They look quite nice. Look, cheese and bacon crisp bakes. Get one of them. Right for plenty of pies in the freezer, aren't we? I know that definite sausage rolls in the freezer still. Pot pie? Or oh, you got enough pot pies? No. Cheese. Definitely cheese. I think Ben's alright for his um, baby bath ones. We'll get some yogurt, yeah? we we'll get some of these for Ben because Ben might like them. Not about £1.69 for eight. Obviously, he loves his yogurts. And they're still they're quite good for the magnesium levels as well for him. Just get one lot of yogurts for Sammy rather than two because he's not eating them very much like he used to, is he? He prefers to have his ice cream with him. Apple juice, he needs apple juice. Ham, get some ham, yeah. So, yeah right for butter. See the boys home from school, Sammy's going straight up the stairs to grab his snacks and his drink, and yeah, he's um, come here with something with his telly. So, anyway, how was school? There we go. Don't wipe your mouth on your curtains, will you? No. So anyway, what, was, what have you had at school today? Um, assembly and loads of lessons. Yeah. That's right. Did they sing happy birthday to you in assembly? Yeah, they did. Even though your birthday was Wednesday? Yeah. And Bill was all right on the bus, wasn't he? Yeah. Yeah. That's good. He didn't fall asleep on the bus for going or coming back, did he? No. That's good. Well, hopefully that's sort of sign so that his medication is working back into his system. Did he, did he, did he attempt to go for his head or not? Yes. Yeah. When was that? Going or coming back? Going. Going. Okay. So we'll have to keep an eye on it. So we go. So I think, I think, okay, it's just like a jerk reaction, isn't it? I think he does it, doesn't he? It's from habit. But anyway, he's, they said he's been all right, didn't they? Yeah. So I'll just wait for your teacher to email, all right? Yeah. Oh, mum and daddy went to B&M this morning, this afternoon. Oh, yeah. We got some. Well, it's maybe mouth. It's drooling. Anyway, we've um got some potatoes to plant tomorrow. All right. Yeah. Yes, yeah, so we can do it with that tomorrow afternoon. Okay. Yeah. yeah so we're gonna leave you to it. And for tea, you can have a choice. I can do your pies because we've been twelve D, or I could just get a bolognese for tea. My pies. You want your pies? 
Yeah. Okay, then the mum and dad have some posh dogs and stuff. And all. Yeah? yeah? You can see Ben's okay. heading off outside. Now, you're right, my darling. He's got, again, he's come home from school so hungry. I think because obviously he's burned off his energy now so quickly because obviously he's moving around quite a bit now, which is really, really lovely to see. Because it's so, so hungry. He's eating this out of the house and home, to be honest with you. What are you doing, darling? Go on, you bounce! You go bounce me trampoline? Yeah, your door used to be there, didn't it? Your door's round this side. Um, Tia, does some help getting on your trampoline? Yeah, come on then, let me help you. Go on then, my sweetheart, that's it. Be careful when we pull it out of the way. That's it. What you get? There's a good boy. And again, like I said, bless him, he does actually struggle to get on this one. Um, one thing I do don't like about this trampoline, like I said before, because it's a netting, it used to come right over here, but then totally different. One's from Atlantic Plum, Atlantic Trampolines to Plum. I suppose you just get what you pay for there, to be honest, if you don't just say, What are you doing, Ben? So you come outside and then tell him to lay down on your trampoline. <laughs> oh, well, bless him. He's been long shit happy, that's the main thing, isn't it? Well, then, guys, a parcel's just arrived from, from Mr. Ben. There's something that he's been waiting for, if Cheryl can get into it. Yeah. Oh, Use mm -hmm. a pair of scissors. Called a bubble storm, isn't it? Oh, this is a bubble storm. Should we try it tomorrow? Yeah. Because bless him, when I'm when well, that was trampoline earlier on, we were looking for his bubbles, wasn't he? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. It, it was. Yeah, is that yours? Is that yours? And we say goodbye to Friday guys and uh, yeah I had to stop the video pretty quick there just a minute ago because uh, we're going to get copyright from the TV. But anyway, yeah, Ben's got his brand new uh, gazillion bubble storm machine arrived so we're going to try that out tomorrow, see how many bubbles that makes in the garden, eh Joel? I don't know how much there's other ones, there's other ones that's got work, doesn't it? Yeah, they do fail, that's the problem with those things. The trouble is if some of the liquid ends up getting in the compartment or something like that, it probably causes damage exactly, to it so yeah. yeah so it's been a you know shopping afternoon getting food shop and B&M earlier on as well I found B&M so boring earlier on that was the first time I ever went in there and thought to myself wow I actually don't want to buy too much from here for a change <laughs> okay. they didn't even have any did they so no they didn't no anyway so yeah, and they look like they're being blitzed on their summer stuff already by the looks of it. Somebody walked out of there with look, it looked like four lights of the sun lounge of things. Yeah, right. it was crazy. They had one of these trolleys and it was all stacked up right up here. Yeah, so that does another day, guys. And the weather is absolutely gorgeous outside. I tell you, it'd be nice to go and have a walk sometime over the weekend if it's like this. I don't, don't even care if we just walk around the lake or down the railway line or something again. You know, you know, we could so. just drive down the lake and have a walk around again. Yeah, I don't really want to push it too far because you know my mind's racing at the moment, thinking you know what's going to happen next with him. You know, it's just worry as a parent. You know, this is worry I haven't had for so long. I knew the head banging was going to eventually have an end, and it did. And how many times did we say about it? What's the point in even moaning? Because, you know, I just feel like everyone around him doesn't really care that much, do they? Well, no, we kept saying, we kept saying, no, it's not behaviour, it's definitely some sort of medical issue. But again, until his magnesium levels are back to normal, there's always going to be that risk. And obviously, he's going to have to deal with it. Yeah, and I'm just really annoyed that his, his two main carers that really did the job with him have no longer there, you know. I'm not really happy with the care agency we've got in at the moment. It really let us down on this one. Like I said, I've had those you should have realised who they should have realised who really did the job, and they did the job, and they just let them go. So it's not really good on their part. They're like I said, they, not a very great care agency at all. Like I said, they've had those 
didn't really manage to get one on the bus. Yeah. Well, you'd have to worry about it much next week because on on here on Monday, on Wednesday next week anyway. So. Wednesday gets his helmet, doesn't he? So. Yeah. So, things should be fine. Yeah. You know, we've done it done it as just a pair of us before. We surely we can do it again. Exactly. Yeah. It's just we've all been through a bad patch over the last twelve months, and I just hope we never see that again. I hope we don't. really don't. I do want to start planning some days out, and if things go well, the weather stays nice. I um, want to take him to the zoo next weekend. And I know he loves going down. I know Sammy loves seeing the giraffes as well. Ben loves the penguins, of course, <coughs> doesn't he? Yeah. Anyway, guys, yeah, as always, hit the like button, hit the dislike button if you want. You won't be able to do that much longer because apparently the dislike button's going to disappear. Yeah, they are, aren't they? Yeah. yeah. Comment down below, and we'll see you tomorrow for another wonderful day. Bye, guys. Bye. Bye.